Okay, so we just uh, had the, the tribute uh, celebration um, for champions and for agencies. Um, I'm going to start uh, with David. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to start with David. David, you're from Ogilvy. You joined as a member of Act Responsible this year, and you actually just won a tribute um, for uh, River Selfie. What do you want? What do? Why did you join Act Responsible? You know, sure. why is it important? I think that we, as an industry and as marketers, have a responsibility, a responsibility and an obligation uh, to to have a positive impact in the world. And sometimes that means by helping our clients drive business performance, but also doing it while we're having an impact on people and on the planet. And I think you know we're incredibly proud to have been recognized today for the work that we did with Dove. Um, with reverse selfie because when you think about how the world has changed over the past two decades, one thing has remained the same is that we know an, uh, an issue that impacts young people and young women in particular is the issue of self-esteem. And the way that Dove has committed, and we talk a lot about purpose as well, and a brand like Dove who has invested in, pur in purpose and in taking action for the better part of two decades, you know, we see the results of that. They are now the world's largest provider of self-esteem education in the world to 82 million young people. And this is, that kind of impact is the kind of thing that you, when you get the letters from parents, when you hear the stories from the people who are featured in the campaigns, because they're not, we don't cast actors in the campaigns, they're real people with real stories. And I think that's the stuff that really inspires me and gets me out of bed every day and where I can see how this industry can really have a meaningful impact and it's brands like Dove that really understand the importance of acting responsibly. Thank you, thank you so much for all those words. And actually, uh, Dove is, um, the, in the retrospective that we put in the Palais, the first CSR campaign that was uh, happened in 2004. So they, start, they were really pioneers and uh, fundamental uh, help uh, uh, is presented. It's a Dove campaign, the first real beauty campaign. Absolutely, and I think one of the things that, you know, we talk a lot about at Ogilvy, and we do a lot of pro bono work for a lot of important causes, um, but I do think we have an obligation to really push our clients, big multinational brands, global brands, to really think about how they can invest in having an impact. Um, because, you know, I think when we want to see change in the world, it's led commercially and through commerce. If, if you underpin it in that way, that's where you'll see the most true impact and the, uh, and the results and the change that we want to see. So that's, you know, I think looking at a lot of the work here and that's being recognized throughout the week, that's one of my big takeaways is that we need to really continue to push our clients with big ideas that are having impact. Thank you. So I'm turning now, now to Brandon. I can't follow that up. No, yeah, you, can, you can actually because Brandon, FCV is like one of our first members. We're very proud of you. Yes, and we've been going and doing millions of things together, especially two spe special things. One is to put together the good report together and you actually won and was an agency not because you put it, because it's just numbers, the good report. Yeah. But uh, we did that together and because you wanted to also inspire the, in the industry and get the agency to uh, work together and also to actually be recognized for, what the, for, for that. So this, this, this is one thing. And the second thing we started together and you guys really pushed us is actually the champion of good. We, yes, we, we feel, you know, I think a lot of what David just said, this industry has the ability to, I think, I think on our best day, we change the minds of consumers. On our very best day in the entire year, we can actually change the minds of the world. And I think a lot of the work we're seeing here, not only in the uh, celebration that we just had here, but the people behind that work. And I think the Champions of Good gets to that, that the people and the organizations that are doing work that is changing the world. And I think it's so important that we pause, take time to celebrate those people because we live in a world right now that's really hard to get things to happen smoothly or effectively. And I think when we can take, take that moment and really recognize that, it helps inspire others, I think, to be a part of it too. So we're happy as an organization, as FCB, to be a part of anything that's helping inspire uh, and make change and cause on um, progressive issues that we see across the Good Report and across what you guys are doing here with Champions for Good. So thank you to the entire team. We love being a part of At Responsible. We love what you guys do. And we're, gonna, we're, we're turning 150 next year. 
and I hope we have 150 years more with you guys. So thank you for all that you do. And actually, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to... Actually, I when when you start, we started the Champion of Good. I had too ma too many things to do, so I was like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, but good idea, yeah. But it's gonna be like, but uh, it's actually I think we need to take the Champion to the next step. We opened we opened the uh, the, the nomination to the participants and to all agencies. We are seeing in the 25 uh, champions that were uh, nominated, they are amazing people. These amazing people could be part of the ACT community. Okay. They could be the inspiring people, as you are, as members, uh, as um, agencies. But I'm going to have to I need, I, I'm going to have to, you know, ask you guys, are you, you know, willing, if we do that, like to help us Absolutely. build this community? Like, Absolutely. you know, both of you are on the advisory board. Well, you know, are, we, are, we, are, we saying, are we telling the others? We yeah. are committing. And I also think, you know, David, you said it when you were speaking earlier. This is a great organization, group of agencies you've got a part of this. We have incredible resources and talent. Let us bring those to full force against common goals that we all have and to help make a change for the world. So, yes, we're fully in from STB. I think, you know, same, same from Ogilvy. I think that, you know, we really, and I'd love actually to even find opportunities for some of the agencies to work together on causes because I think we as an industry, you know, like I said, I, like I said we have an obligation, uh, especially on certain issues, to really be driving change. There was a conversation that happened um, in the Palais over the, that uh, our chief creative officer, Liz Taylor, moderated about the issue of bias. And I think, you know, we as an industry, through the advertising and the way that we serve media in some ways, are in some ways responsible for creating certain biases in the world. And I think when you have some of those issues, it's important for us in, for as, an, as an industry to look at ourselves in the mirror and realize where we can try to, you know, right some wrongs and really do some good in the world and trying to make the world uh, the place that we all deserve for it to be. Um, and sometimes that means us working together and creating open source programs and tools that we can all leverage and the IBM rolled out a program this week that was uh, kind of in that regard and that's really what I'd like to see the industry doing more of and I think organizations like Act Responsible I think really help us and create a forum for some of those conversations to be had. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you both. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Hi, Mayor. We celebrated the 20th anniversary of the Act Responsible Organization. Can you tell us some words for the girls, for Hervé? No, I mean, I congratulate Hervé, uh, Isabel, Sophie, and the entire team of Act Responsible. Uh, of because when I first met Hervé 11 years ago, and he told me about what it's about, it's about creativity for good. It's also about giving hope and inspiration through storytelling for ideas and campaigns that can change the world. That's what we need. The world is in crisis on multiple levels and to change that, the, world, the work of the UN is important but it needs to be supported by creativity and creativity can help us change people's behavior, change people's minds and when we do that, we succeed together. Thank you very much. And, uh, Congrats for your prize. Thank you. Yeah, no, it's a great honor to be involved. Uh, Harvey and his team have built an amazing organization for 20 years that supports probably the most critical role that advertising plays in the world, which is to promote good. And so I'm very honored to be a part of it and to support it in any way. I feel like I joined the advisory board like around COVID, so I didn't really get a chance to interact a lot with the team in real life. And so it's been a great pleasure to see everybody here in Cannes. And this is obviously one of the most important events for Act Responsible. It really highlights the work in the right way and showcases it to the entire world. And happy birthday. Yeah, happy birthday, 20 years. Amazing. As Euronews, we are very happy to, uh, to be part of the project of Act Responsible uh, and to have created the, the, the one minute responsibility, uh, which allows us to uh, showcase uh, advertising. Uh, a campaign all around the world uh, to um, 160 countries, uh, over uh, 400 million uh, households, and uh, in approx 17 languages. So it's a great honor yeah. for us. First of all, I want to say happy birthday, but also I want to say it's always good to be pioneer because the topic of the year today is sustainability, is acting for good, and we see all many brands doing that. Who was thinking about that 20 years ago? Act responsible. So happy birthday.
happy anniversary, as responsible. Keep doing what you are doing. We love you. We love you. Karin, thank you very much to uh, welcome us, uh, Act Responsible, here on, on your beach, the famous beach RTL. And maybe you have some words for the team. We love Act Responsible. Great job. It's amazing. It's so emotional. It's, uh, it's so important. to, to And uh, we uh, really uh, love you and happy anniversary. Stefan. Yes. Uh, you are a supporter of uh, Act Responsible since, since a long time. Uh, yes, yeah, since beginning. the beginning. Since the beginning. beginning. Maybe you have some words for the girls. Of course. Uh, congratulations. Isa, Sophie, Hervé, uh, you are incredible. Everything that you're doing is a symbol for us of sustainability, diversity, equality. Thank you very much. And? Oh, happy birthday. Thank you. 20 years, 20 years for them. And uh, happy birthday to the, to the girls. Happy birthday to Hervé. Hervé. Happy birthday, Isa. Happy birthday, Sophie because uh, I really admire what you do and still doing for all this uh, next year, we hope. Let's, uh, let's see us uh, next year here. So, uh, finally, Hervé, some words. Happy birthday to us, happy birthday to us, happy birthday, act responsible, happy birthday to us. Thank you, Hervé. In the box.